Hey, this is Greg, and we're going to do a demo of the CP100 tracking system with the uh, BlackBerry application built in. First of all, we're going to power the unit up. And we are outside, so we're getting our location given back to us by GPS. It's powered on. Put it on the dash. Blackberry. Turn it on. We're actually going to go to the custom built application called Backtracks. Okay, so here's the main screen for Backtracks have the menu on the side, you got the phone number, registration, you've got the local time, report period, safe zone, current location of the unit, the SMS messages that it sends back, and the actual map. So let's go back to the phone number. There's the phone number of my unit. Registration, we're going to send the registration to the unit again. We are using the BlackBerry Bold 9700. Uh, we've tried this on the 9000, 9700, and they've both been successfully uh, working. There we go. We've got our SMS message back. If we want to view that SMS message, we go to the SMS message, and there it's set point. Everything's okay with the unit. So we go back, and let's see if we can get the current location of the unit. We are using two separate carriers. We're using Bell Mobility for the phone, the BlackBerry phone. We're using uh, Rogers Communications for the uh, the unit itself. So we do have two different carriers going on this, not just one GSM carrier. So now we're going to view the map, and there we see the point. Within this application, we've uh, created waypoints where you can actually, as you go along, if you set your report period right here, you can set that to whatever you'd like it to be, up to, I think it's 60 or 80 minutes or something like that. You can uh, report, have the unit report back to you with the uh, waypoints. So every time you move, the application is going to show a little dot on here. There you can see on the uh, image itself, it shows 0000, so that's the first point. So, that's the introduction to the backtracks. You can set the safe zone. Um, we've added a feature into this unit so that it actually gets your coordinates. Uh, on the other unit, the Windows Mobile unit, we notice that there is no current location, so we actually get the coordinates of your current location. Uh, and put that into the safe zone and add that in. And the other features, of course, the local time. And that's about it. Thanks.